In this video I'm going to show you how to do the crank test to diagnose slap lesions. Get our very own assessment ebook and mobile app. Links are in the video description. Hi and welcome back to PhysioTutors. Gismervik et al. in the year 2017 performed a meta-analysis of shoulder tests for slap lesions and found that the crank test had a sensitivity of 46% and a specificity of 72%. For this reason, the crank test has a weak clinical value in the detection of slap tears. The crank test can either be conducted with the patient in sitting or supine position, like in this example. Then bring his shoulder into 160 degrees of elevation in the scapular plane and flex the elbow to 90 degrees. Then apply an axial load with one hand and bring the patient's shoulder into repeated internal rotation followed by external rotation in an attempt to pinch the torn labrum. This test is positive in case of clicking with or without pain or apprehension by the patient. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to learn the most accurate test in the meta-analysis by Gis Mervik, check out our video on the compression rotation test in the video right next to me. Thanks a lot for watching. Please give this video a like before you leave. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet and follow us on various social media platforms. This was Kai for PhysioTutors. I'll see you next time. Bye.